Hey guys, and today we'll be reviewing the Godzilla 2014 Smash Drink. So, before we get to look at the figure, the figure, 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 wow, figure, let's look at the packaging. So, on the packaging, we have Smash Strike, Godzilla, very nice. On the side, you have, a, you have a picture of Godzilla's tail, very nice picture of Godzilla on the box itself. On the side, it says Smash Strike with a picture. On the back, we have instructions on how to use the figure. Smash Strike in many different languages. Uh, Tail Strike, another figure in the Bandai America Godzilla 2014 series. And then some logos. So, let's get them unboxed. Boop! Done. Let's get the packaging out of the way. And, let's get the figure. So, my camera focus, 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 oh, there you go. So, let's look at the detail on the figure. Detail, it's, it's okay. It's okay. I'm going to say that much. It's okay. They could have done a way bigger job with detail on the figure. But, it is a kid's toy. I mean... For a kid's toy, it's actually pretty cool. So yeah, um, very. N some aspects look actually pretty cool, like the spikes. They look decent. They look nice. Uh, the head could have been better. The tail, yeah, uh, never mind. There's a lot of drawbacks on this figure. I mean, the screw holes they don't look very nice. These arm hinges right here, they're not, they're not too tight. They, 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 well, they're kind of, sta it kind of stays there, but it's very weak. It's not that great. Uh, for its action, it, that's, that's what it does. I'll show you. That, that's, that's it. That's it. It's, it's, uh, that, that doesn't work. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it has that, but I'm not too, I'm okay with it, I mean, at least this one stands, tail strike, but anyway, <laughs> so yes, yeah, it's, it's detail could have been better. Articulation, arm, swivels, not 360, uh, lower, hand, lower arm. Moves. Okay. Uh, jaw moves. I don't know if you can, if you would consider this, if you consider that waist movement. I guess. Legs. They don't move. It's it's real. It's, it moves relatively. Doesn't move that much, but it kind of moves. And tail has no articulation. So that's one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Excuse me. Well, eight, if you want to count that. Uh, so yeah, it has eight points of articulation. Color. It's it's like the NECA figure. It doesn't have much to do it. If you look at it, it's, it's black with the tan. Most Godzilla 2014 toys are gonna have that. They're gonna have the black, then the tan, then the highlights. Yellow eye, white teeth. Done. That's all they're gonna have with them. So, this figure doesn't really bring us much. But, it's a kid's toy. I can live with it. I mean, in October, we're getting the SH Monster Arts, so, it, it's, 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 seventy dollars. I'm probably gonna get it. I don't know. I don't know where I can get it in October. I mean, if they have it online, tell me in the comments. Does SH Monster Arts does H does Time Machine Nations have like a website where I can like buy this stuff or something? Because like, you can order it online. Maybe I can pre-order it. I don't know. Maybe I I checked on Amazon and um, they don't. I don't think they have it. 
So if you guys tell me in the comments if they if like Tom C Nations has like a website or like a Facebook page leading to the website. So yeah, because I have no idea if they have one or not. So yeah, that's it for the Smash Strike figure. Very cool. It's a very nice figure. It stands about six inches tall. So yeah.